Cowboy Dipper here, and sorry I haven't made a video in a while. Um, I was doing a little bit of roping there for a while, or well, not a lot of it. Just the days that I were that I was roping, um, they were the days that I were making videos, or were supposed to make videos. Sorry, but my shoutouts are Crystal Mick. Robbie McRobbie and Todd Mick Mick La Yeah Todd a Todd Todd Mick M C E L W A I N and that's M C E L W A I N Yeah A I N Sorry I don't know how to pronounce your last name but I don't, so sorry. Um, I was never the best reader or speller, but good enough. So I'll be spitting in the A. Dylan Hart Jr. mud jug. They're going to be retiring some mud jugs. The oil one will be retired whenever they run out and the green alien one whenever they run out so you better go ahead and get you one while you can so now I'm going to show you this shotgun. That's what we're reviewing. And the way I review shit is I kind of talk about them, tell you my thoughts on them, and then sometime in the future, if you guys want, I'll do a shooting part to show you how accurate it is. And I'll try to do that with different people so I me using it versus someone else like my brother or whoever but this is what the gun is so it's a really nice gun when I got it um, they I don't know if there was any more at the time they were hard to find I don't know if they brought them back if they're anywhere or not but the brand of this shotgun is KBI HBG PA made in Turkey and it says on the other side it's a Charles Daily 106 12 gauge minus three and they are worth 525 so I got a deal on this gun when I found it um, it's a double barreled shotgun do I like double barreled shotguns I don't mind them do I prefer this one or a pump um, It don't matter to me, pumps are easier if you don't know how to run these different these different buttons right here. Um, so it shoots really nice. Uh, there's the gun again. So <clears throat> do I use both barrels when I trap shoot? No, I do not. Um, I try to use just one because I don't know how to use them both. Now what I mean by I don't know how to use them both is I can get one down and then no, not the other. So if you want me to do like uh, part two to the 22 and this... Um, 
shotgun and what I mean by part two is just shoot them and show you how accurate they are I can surely do that it'll just be later on in the future so that means we'll be outside shooting them a little bit and another thing is um, I guess this brand of gun is hard to find to find I don't know if that's true or not but at the time when I was looking for a shotgun it was hard to find what I like about this gun is it's wherever you point it and and pull the trigger that's where it's gonna shoot it's never been been off that I know of it's just that's sometimes I don't know how to aim very well with it so I like call aim and think it's good enough and then when I shoot it's actually off my shooting but the gun ain't um, a lot of people do like this gun they tell me I have a pretty good gun um, I love it I think it's great I really do now what would I give this gun overall I would give it out of 10 I'd give it 10 I'm giving it 10 out of 10 for double barreled um, it's never it's never stirred me wrong um, it is a well put together gun there's nothing wrong with it at all anybody that's ever shot it has said the same thing um, if you're wondering where it's made, if I didn't say, it was made in Turkey. This is what it says on this gun. So, yeah, I give this 10 overall. Um, you know what, I'll just go ahead and do the shooting part on them in the future on all my guns and different guns and crap. Just to let you guys know how accurate they are and how on the gun is so that's about it um, tell me if you've ever shot one of these type of guns and how well you think it is let me know um, that was just my little review um, see the trigger it's never jammed up on me the only time it's ever jammed up on me is because it wasn't clean because I didn't clean it but other than that it's a great gun it's my trap shooting gun and that's all that I use it for I know you can use it for rabbits and other crap like that rabbits you guys should know what all you can shoot with it if not look it up um the bullets that i get for it are the black shotgun bullets the cheaper ones that don't kick when they're shot out of it um so thanks for tuning into this video Keep on packing up, time for seven. Keep on rotting the gums. Keep on spitting the black. Thumbs up the video, like the video, share the video. I will get more into this gun when I shoot it. I will do a little bigger and better part two review on it. This is just me kind of talking about it, but. And it breaks open pretty easy. But I think it needs cleaned. But anyways, that's my review. Thank you. And go check out those other channels I told you about. Sorry I butchered your name, Todd. Um, I think when I got this gun I spent maybe two or three hundred on it maybe. Somewhere there, I think, but I can't remember. But I got it for a steal, really. 
So, here it is. I'll show it to you one more time. So, thanks for tuning into this video. Um, I'm out now.